Hey everyone, Yeti here, and welcome back to another episode of my Oblivion Permadeath playthrough. I'm just checking audio, okay, yeah. Yeah, it's my first recording of the day, so I just wanted to check audio and stuff. What did we do in the last episode? We accidentally broke through someone's home. That's fine, we, I mean, we don't really need to, don't really need to worry about that. No, game don't crash, okay, thank you. What are we doing now, though? That's the real question. I have the fourth and last where we can piece together clues. Um, Tarmina is where we're looking for, and she is in the university. Okay. Yeah, we're doing this Oblivion um, episode something. I, I think this is episode 10. Reason being is because episode I uploaded episode 7, and I mean, I've already, this is already, by the time this goes up, then this is already sorted, but, um, Fonge. Uh, in the end of episode 7, we started a quest, and then that took like three episodes, and I lost those episodes. Which I felt bad about losing episodes, especially in a permadeath, but what? honestly, the quest was really boring, so. You know, Mythic Dawn. Interesting words. Do I win? No, stop talking. I think I won. What now? Quests. Tarmina says that Mankar Kamoran said a message within his writings. The Enlightened Ones could join him in the Mythic Dawn. I just studies these. Oh, for fuck's sake. I don't want to read them. Right, I'm going to read the books then. And I'm going to put an annotation in the top right. So if you want to skip me reading the books, then you can. Do I have to read the whole book? Fuck that. Oh, these are increasing my description skill. I wonder if I can just go through if I don't actually have to read them, actually. In which case, there won't be an annotation. Oh, that increase like, all four of them? Okay, maybe I do have to. I'm not reading all these. Right, let me just take a moment to read this. Do I have to read all these? Um, hidden message within his writing so only the enlightened world could join him in the mythic dawn. I should study these books some more. Do you really want me to read them? I don't want to read them. Okay, I'm going to cut and come right back. Okay, we are back and I actually just um, listened okay. to what she said because I wasn't skipping through it. And she actually said, um, I was thinking it myself and then see if I come up with any ideas, check back with me tomorrow. So I am going to wait 24 hours and then try again. Um, yeah, maybe I should have actually listened to her, but <laughs> I'm not going to cough. Sorry about that. But um, I know, I don't think it's worth listening to everything that everyone says, just in case someone says something that might be useful. Why is there mouse acceleration all of a sudden? Whatever. Um, what? But maybe I should listen a bit in the future. I the dawn. Up copies of the first two volumes, main car camera. Ah, but more yeah. to the point. I'll continue to study the problem. Oh, for fuck's sake! <laughs> Twenty-four more hours. Hopefully, she does this because I really can't bother reading them myself. And if it's like cryptic, then there's no way I'm gonna be able to figure it out. <laughs> Stuff like that is like way beyond me. It's quite early in the morning. Never mind, it's quite late in the evening. <laughs> Yeah, yes. I'm back. I've just been stood outside for a day. Figured out the hidden message. Yes. Excellent. Let's see. Yeah. Write this down. Green M. I <laughs> Write this down. Okay, do we do it? Tarmino has discovered a message. Green Emperor Way where tower touches the midday sun. I should go to the Green Emperor Way. See what can be found. So I need to go to the Green Emperor Way and have a look then. A little bit of a look. Travel to the Imperial City Palace. Um, which is over here. What's the stable outside the city gate suite? So wait, where's the green gone? Tomb of Prince Cameron, that's probably not it. Get the local map, but... Oh, maybe it is. Australia? Oh no, it's the Oblivion, isn't it? Right, what's happening here? I'm looking at this. What am I looking for or at? I think this, because this actually has something on it. Look, it's got the Mythic Dawn logo. Should I try waiting? Oh, this is confusing. See what can be found. Nothing can be found. There's nothing here. I wonder if there's anything on top of it. That doesn't seem to make any sense, but I'll have a look. Of course there isn't. What is this pressing E on it actually doing? 
look on the ground. I have a feeling this episode might take a lot of editing. Where the tower meets the midday, the midday sun. The midday sun. The minute. Okay. How many hours is that? Half. It's half nine now. So half ten. So that'll put me in midnight. So I want fifteen hours. Yeah. Okay. I think it'll like do something. At half ten. Half at midday. <laughs> half ten. It's not where the fuck half ten came from. Twelve thirty-four. Shit. I went over. Yo, I'm here. Fuck. I can redo. Wait, no, I don't want 24 hours, do I? I want 23. Right, let's wait till we're close and then I'll cancel it. Actually, it's probably not a great idea. Oh, I got it. Okay, so now I need to just what, wait. Okay, I'll just um, inspect these. I wonder if there's anything interesting actually in this graveyard. Doesn't look like it. Looks like just some stuff to look at. Anyone hanging out here that's gonna be like, yo, what are you doing? What's that? Okay. What sword do I have? Oh, I have this! I need to test this out at some point. Murdering some fools. 11.48. Yo! Cool it. Tomb of Prince Camaril. I followed the clues hidden in the four volumes written by Mankar Camorin to a gravestone in Green Emperor Way. Oh, that's the name of the grave area. A new and a map of Cyrodiil appeared on the gravestone with the location of the Mythic Dawn Shrine marked in it. And if I might wait to try and locate the, the Amulet of Kings. So it's going to be like what? Up here? Oh. Okay. <laughs> There's a good job I got the Desolate Mine. That's going to cut down the journey a bit. I don't want to take my horse with me. Because I don't want it to die. <laughs> nice. Dodge and weave, dodge and weave, dodge and weave, dodge and weave. Nice. Stay there. Don't die, Tony. Thank you. Right, just stay alive. Ah, 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 ah. Make the BGs proud. <laughs> okay. Where are we going? This way. Ah, 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 ah. Stay alive. Okay. Oh, there's a camp down there. Camps are usually interesting. They usually have people at them. But we will leave that for now. I keep pressing right click thinking it's going to zoom in because in Fallout. If you've got like your weapon away, when you right click it like zooms in a bit so you can look. But this just keeps <laughs> pulling out my shield. Hopefully people don't go mental at me. Oh, should I have got a disguise or something? I don't suppose I have any. Oh, this is like the worst disguise in <laughs> the city guard of Kavach. Oh, that's nice. A little waterfall over there. Oh, is this where we're going? Hmm, nice. The older view distance stuff is like max, so I can see stuff relatively far away. Or as far as the game would allow. You found Lake Arius Caverns, which is where I'm going. Where's the entrance? Oh, here we go. Oh, this is neat. Oh, I quite like this. This would be an awesome place to live, like in this cave, assuming it had Wi Fi, electricity, and hot water. I've arrived at Lake Arius Caverns. The secret Mythic Door Shrine must be somewhere inside. Do I want to have my weapon out for this? Yo. Dawn is breaking. You seem like a freak. Greet the new oh, day. Brother. The hour is late, but the map you may pass into the Do not tarry. <laughs> Don't worry, there'll be no tar tarrying where I go. I am Harrow. Yo. Warden of the shrine. By following How the interesting. Path of dawn, Hidden in the writings of the master. Oh no, listen to him, I don't want to fucking even up. At an opportune time. As a member of the Order of the Mythic Dawn, give me your possession. What? Very good. Oh, for fuck's sake. I don't do I wanna be in the Mythic Dawn? This is they'd never get any recruits for this though, because you have to have all four books to be able to be recruited, and the fourth one's like the rarest thing in existence. No one would ever join. Dawn is breaking? Yeah, dude. Oh, another follow thing. How does this work, though? Do I have to join? Is it not like, oh, I choose between... 
Yeah, I think I have to join to get the Amulet of Kings, okay. So it's like um, going undercover then. I thought it might be like um, in Skyrim where you gotta choose between like the Greybeards, the Greybeards or like whoever the other one was. So like if you choose to go against the Greybeards, the Greybeards don't like you anymore. Are we just gonna stand here? Oh. Where is he? Should I go down there? And we hold the amulet of kings, oh you're gonna get fucked up. Storm's coming, buddy. Storm is coming for you. <laughs> you there. Fucking watch your ass. Hear now the words of Lord Dagon. Has he got a satanic Bible? What happens if I go up there? Will he be like, yo, to get down? That book is going up your ass, I hope you know. As for the rest. She's talking. The Dickhead. This is really fucking. Oh, is that the, the forearm guy that plays guitar? Oh no, that's definitely not a guitar player. He's like a massive sword coming off his arm. Oh, is that the fucker from Shiver and Isles that took me fucking forever to get past? Some like giant guardian of the gate, which is like a giant troll with like a massive sword for an arm or some shit. So we fucking ages to get past him. <gasps> Yo, dog. That's kind of inappropriate, don't you think? Whoa, 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 whoa. Chill. Call it, mister. Uh, Manka Morin escaped. That was Manka Morin? Shit, I should have just sliced his wooden spine. Uh, but the Mizzle is out is in the shrine. I must get them bizarre as these it's my only over final way to recover the amulet. Do, do, do. You have come to dedicate yourself to Lord this Yeah, that's exactly what I'm doing here. Sealed with red drink. Take up the dagger and offer Lord Dagon the sacrificial red drink as pledge of your own Yo, I will slay the sac Ah uh, This is one of my dudes though. I've seen a lot of TV, so I know that like when you're like deep undercover, you've got to fucking do everything and shit. But right, I'm gonna say I will, but I don't Lord think I'm going Dagon to. thirsts for red drink. Advance, oh, he's still alive. Yo, this is like way beyond me. So it's gotta be with the silver dagger, right? I'm gonna lead him on. Oh, I don't have my weapon. Oh shit. <laughs> Yo, yep. Kill the lizard. Drink his blood. Chop his nutsack off. Yeah, kill him. I'm I'm about to kill him. Ah! You just fucking die, son of a whorebag. That kid better not die. No, fucking leave it. Shit, I hit him. Run! Piece of shit. Fucking saved your ass. What are you doing? Yo. Um, a thanks would be nice. Dude, what? You're not even gonna. Arsehole. You better wait outside to give me, like. Well, I mean, he's not got anything on him, but. <laughs> ah! Irony. <laughs> there you go. Here's all the fucking red drink you fucking want. Take your staff, though. And your golds. I also want this, don't I? Take. Yes. I have the Mixerian and the Bucket here to escape Cloud Rule Temple. Okay. Yo, dude. Who Whoa, Jesus. Oh, <laughs> Nice. Do, 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 do. Gates. The gate is open, for fuck's sake. Anyone know where the lever is? <laughs> Guys, can someone open this for me? I was just checking I have a console there, just in case I get... Oh shit, I think I see it. Ow! Oh, bugger. Why am I pressing the wrong button? I nearly died then, that was... That would have been bad, but kind of funny. Oh, do I have to go this way? Of course I do. Oh, there's a door right here. I wonder what would have happened if I killed him. Living quarters, for fuck's sake. I come in peace. I'm lying, I'm gonna 
shank your ass. Yo, the armor's on fair. I have seven gold. Nice. Loaded. Rolling in it. Oh, get, get. Wait, where are you going? I'm taking all your stuff. You guys need a gobble. Where are you going? Oh, I'm rapid with this. Yes. Where's the exit? There isn't one. Jesus, it smells right. I kind of just want to run through and go... Just ignore everything. Uh, these guys aren't exactly hard, though. No, I want to kill them all, because these are the Mythic Dawns. So these are, like, the, the bad guys. So I guess if I kill, like, most of them in their own base, that'll make things easy. I keep running away. No, you two are dead. This is like in the Warcraft 3 video when I had one peon left. Or one grunt, where I don't remember what I was playing as. And I was like running him halfway across the map and setting up a base. I was like, we can do it. We only need one guy to win. Building a town hall halfway across the map. That's what these guys are going to do. They're going to run and then they're going to find a new cave and start up again. That's what ants do. There we go. Well. They run far. They're still running. <laughs> Just leaving all like these guys as decoys. Anti chamber, don't want to go in there. Hell of a hard game. <laughs> I know it was spelled differently, but still, it's a joke. Unbeliever. No, I believe in I believe in the planes of oblivion. Trust me. I fucking experience it more than you have. Oh shit, we're going up to the end of the video. Oh, I've caught a couple of minutes though, so I have a couple of minutes left, I think. I think that was the right way to go. I'm just following these bitch asses. This wall won't shift. They managed to get through it. Oh. I, these things usually annoy me in Oblivion because it's... They don't really provide any challenge. It's just a case of... Find the, the thing. The lever that activates it or whatever. But sometimes they're in like really annoying places and it takes me like an annoying amount of time to actually find it. I've escaped. Okay, we need to go to the Cloud Ruler Temple, which is up here. I confused me for a second because the marker wasn't on the place. So we'll go hand this in and then we'll call it quits. I don't like leaving him outside, but... Yeah, that's pretty dope. Okay. Yeah, he's going to stay there for the time being. Shit, I don't have any of my stuff. Ah, oh, crap. I bet that was in the antechamber. I could do with getting that back. <laughs> Sorry. Do you have? Please tell me. Ah, good. Yeah, but I don't have any of my stuff. Uh, I think actually, I'll go and try and get that off camera. If like, I'll, cause I don't know if I can actually get my stuff back or not. Like definitely. Probably said something really useful there. Yeah, I don't know if I can like definitely get my stuff back. So what I'll do is I will off camera go and try and find it. Cause I don't want to be wearing this crap for the rest of my life. But yeah, so I'm, if you like this episode, sure leave a like. If you loved it, surely a favorite. Let me just read that this says. Uh, Martin asked me to speak to Joffrey. Okay, well I'll do that in the next episode. Um, but yeah, so I'm just gonna go and see if I can actually get my stuff back. Hopefully it doesn't like despawn, because I know sometimes there's like a thing in this game where if you leave stuff in chests that you don't own, they're not always there when you come back. I, mean, I think it's even like something they actually mentioned in the one of the loading screen tips. So I'm going to go and have a look in that antechamber, but I'll do it off camera. So if you like this episode, surely leave a like. If you loved it, we should leave a favourite. I have no lock picks. Um, yeah, we should have more money. Follow me on Twitter for tweets. Twitch for streams. My name is Vinay, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Please come back here, you dickhead. I'm, he's just out of reach. Oh, he's going in like that. You know what, actually? Let me just explore this antechamber. Oh, this is literally where I was, wasn't it? I just can't get in. Storeroom key. 
Yo, the storeroom sounds like something which would have my stuff. Right, we'll just make this an, an extended episode. I know I said I was going to do it off camera, but I changed my mind, like, really quickly. Dagon Shrine, which is where we just were. Lake Arias Caverns. Shrine, so the Shrine Antichamber and the Dagon Shrine are different things then, yo. For the sake of, I can't be bothered walking all the way around, we're just going to use this awesome spell that I got. I picked it up off one of their bodies, don't worry, it's just a really good spell. Right, so is there another door in here to a storeroom? That's to the antechamber. Where's the, s the storerooms then? Oh, wait, this is where the book was, so what's the antechamber? So, altar. <laughs> That's a bed. The class has a bed, nice. Well, let me try and go back to where they actually took my stuff, because maybe it's there. Uh, and then I'll check this antechamber, because I think it is actually a different room. Hi. Oh, he's just going to stay there, isn't he? Because his collision's off. So they took my stuff around here. Unless he has it, just kind of carried on him? No. So I was like over here, wasn't I? Oh, in here, maybe? No, this isn't a room. Yo, dude, where's my stuff? The Lord Dagon. I do not fear death. This is another shrine. I really want my stuff back. If I can't find it in the next couple of minutes, I will try and, like, watch a video on it or something. Oh, they've got the Mythic Dawn commentaries. Because I'm not losing that Kavach armor. So badass. Right, so where's... This is the Dagon Shrine. Oh, we've not even been over here. Wooden door hard. Oh, this is the storeroom key. Okay. So in theory, this should be the storm room, storeroom then. So my stuff should be in here, right? I'll actually take that castle in here. I mean, where did they put it? Shit. It better not be in here. No, no. Dude, come on. <laughs> no. Okay, well, I am going to go now, so I hope you enjoyed. I will find this stuff, hopefully. Peace off, guys.